Garen, lovely. Let's play against the Garen again. Second Garen matchup from today. We go for... B -b 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 yeah, everything is good. We got Little Temple, I go Diskit and Cosmic because I play Flesh Knight and the rest is looking solid. Every move you made, I was watching you. If you're serious about improving and climbing to your desired league rank, you're in the right place. This year, I've worked on laying out two courses that will help you in all aspects to improve. One is about all the fundamentals for the laning phase, and the other one goes in-depth on tempo and the mid to late. I've been challenger for seven years, and I can guarantee you that this will massively speed up your process and reaching any goal that you have set in mind. Both courses have a preview video where you can see the style of the videos, so check those out before anything. You can also always join my Discord to check out some reviews. All right, let's get into the video. Uh, this matchup, okay, so he's playing Conqueror Sorcery, right? So he's playing the setup with Nimbus and Celerity. He does not have Bone Plating, he does not have Face Rush. So I can really look for extended fights into him easily. He can't really escape me. How should you play to win this against Jax? Well, the thing is, how this matchup goes is Jax wins level 1 to level 3, and then Garen starts winning. But if Jax wins the matchup level 1 to level 3, then Garen can't really come back. Oh, I got D-Shoot, by the way, not D-Blade. I'm gonna play super aggressive in the early game in this matchup, though, chat. Again, he's playing Conqueror Sorcery. He is no resolve, he's no face rush, right? So I can really look to play super aggressive early. UJGG predicts you're gonna lose the lane. UJGG can suck my nuts. Please not to Garen. Okay, Garen has D shoot. <laughs> this guy is gonna hit level 2 from the first 6 minutes now, by the way, Chet, because he got EXP from the assist. So keep that in mind. Garen had E start, right? He was Eing my Lilia, so he does not have Q start. He has two potions as well. Ah, there. A battle cry before your feet down, Garen. I'm gonna stack my passive here. It's an okay trade. Just sucks that he has two potions. Try to abuse my level of timer there. I'm gonna do the second wave crash because Sunyan is passing the top and I hate Kindred in the early game. Such a cheesy champion. Good last thing by that guy. Very nice how he set up the means. Very nice. Abuse my level 3 there. Got a second potion. Kindred is still passing into top, but so is Lilia. I don't think they can kill me here. He wants the cannon. Garen is gonna have to make a choice, he collects this or he recalls, or he tries to hard push next wave, but he's not sure if I've recalled or not. So Garen should have instantly hard push next wave, which should give me enough time to come back into lane and maybe even freeze it. So I'm gonna run back, I'm not gonna go to full HP, and this is where Garen has to make a choice. Does he recall or try to push next wave? Looks like he wants to recall, maybe he pivots and tries to push anyways. He has to kind of make the choice here. Alright, by recalling, it's still good for me, because this wave is pushing towards me, so I will still benefit from this, right? He's losing all the XP, he's already lost uh, more than I have, plus the wave will still push it to me, uh, like, once he's getting back, so I still always benefit. Right, so he's lost the full wave, I still have these three casters and the melee me in here, so... And he's gonna lose a little bit from this wave too, so... He's lost the full wave already, he lost another melee, right? So, that is why it's still worth for me to do, like, the slow push to hard push. I use W at least. My E comes back a little bit faster than his W. It's okay trade. Gary has to choose now. Does he record or does he stay? There's no W. Honestly, I just outplayed me with the flush. The problem there is, is I can't cancel my E manually because it just deals less damage because of the bug. So I can't... Mm, no, I should just recall it. Recalling was fine. If I just recalled, it was fine. And the wave would push into me again and I would just be completely fine. It was just a flippy play and I lost and I need to not complain. I just... I just griefed it. Alright, we're in trouble now though. If you manually cancel Jax's E at the moment, your E deals less damage. That's a bug currently. I have flash to get get post first, and then I have Q2. Now I need to slow push this wave and then hard push this wave. I have flash to keep the gap close, so I can keep auto attacking. And then by flashing, I can use my Q as damage to keep auto attacking in the meantime too. I actually secure the kill. It just sucks how I have to push this wave here. I couldn't push it slower. Okay, nice, massive. Building HP is kind of worth it. 
for me because of his ult and ignite kind of one-shotting me so i was considering building kindle gem here and to be fair i should have i shouldn't have finished call Fuge. i should have built a full kindle gem because if i build a full kindle gem he cannot kill me anymore but i can still kill him so i made a mistake here Wow, my champion is broken. What the hell? I mean, he mistimed this W though. Okay, now let's do it correctly. Slow push this wave. Allow this next wave to walk through the lane and then hard push. Holy shit, I actually kill him there. That's crazy. I don't even know the limits on this champion, but that was kind of crazy that I killed him. I'm not gonna finish uh, boots here because I'm very close to my mythic. The faster I get to my mythic, the better. So I'm not gonna buy boots here. Garen is slow pushing. This is a mistake. It forced him to walk up for last hits. 10 20 for his flash. Kindred could be top here though, playing for this. Why is this Kindred also rushing Kindle Gem on his first reset? What is this thing with Jungle's rushing Kindle Gem on the first reset? Let's try and get level 9 here. I'm not sure where Kindred is at. Again, I wanna play for 700 gold because then I have item in base here. Still not sure where Kindred is at. Slow push this wave, hard push next. Then I have ignite and maybe flash two. He gets flash again in a second. Good cute timing. I have ignite soon. I want to dive. Need my Lilia. Okay. Ah, I still die. I mean, I should have played for Mythic. I still have both my sums. I think it's okay, actually. Kindred did ult. Garen still loses this entire fat wave, but Kindred gets it. He's gonna freeze it here, of course. Ooh, my mid laner is in a lot of problems. And bot lane too. Holy moly, my entire team is getting stomp renoed. Yo, I did too. I'm not sure what champion I want to do after Jax yet. The council can vote in Discord. Type estimation mark Discord. I will do a poll in Discord soon again, where people can Please choose the next champion. We have full Mythic now, so we are very strong. I want to start playing for plates. Watch this damage. Yes, sir. Every time I want to just W auto him and bonk him. Bonk. Bonk. He has exhaust still. I mean, I'm bonking well. I can't resist. I gotta play too. Worth. I can't resist it. I can't resist it. Type one in chat if you would have done the same. Played and a kill. So not worth it. He's gonna have full mythic now from that. Yo, my team is not really, you know, smurfing at this game. To put it mildly. I've had some bad teams, mate. But I've made some mistakes this game too. I don't really control the game anymore because I died three times myself. So I don't really have a lead because I died three times. It's my mistakes too. If I had played more disciplined and a little bit more better, I could maybe control this game. But I died too much. Maybe it's time to start roaming. Holy shit, that Alistar combo! Didn't do shit though. But the thing is, if I roam, he gets the full turret. That's like a bait too. Sidian, thank you for four months! Thank you guys! I have a quiz tomorrow, boss. Can you give me some encouraging words to start studying? A quiz? Why are you studying for a quiz? You mean like an exam? Like a test? A quiz? What are you doing, bingo night? No, I'm kidding, bro. Go study, cause else you either... Bro, I don't know. I hate studying. How can I be motivating? Oh, shit, bro. You're not... I, I'm not the right one to ask. Just study, because else you're gonna regret it. Like this Lilia regrets coming topside. Thank you, Lilia. Yes, Jax only has 80 scaling on his Q. Look, physical damage. But this W and this E and his ult do magic damage. Well, thank you, Lilia, for coming topside. Kindred ganks me 50 times. Lilia comes top. Gets a little kill to Garen. Lovely. Not sure if I can carry this game. If I killed the Garen there, it would be massive because of his shutdown, but yeah, couldn't kill him. He flashed though. I'm very close to item. I think I just buy Cleaver here so I actually spike. I need to buy something here. If I don't spike on this Rico, I'll never get strong. I need to buy something strong now so that I can kill him on this wave. Alright, <laughs> thank you, plants. Okay, we got a shot down. Massive. Can win now, maybe? It's crazy how I just Tars entered to the lane again. We need to buy magic resist now, too. I think I might just get this item as well. Why not? No, I should get a bit sent, probably. Oh, the moly. My entire team is so far behind. This guy doesn't have stoppage anymore, though. If I can get the shot down, too, I can get this turret, too. Maybe we're Barak. We're so Barak.
Where is she? She's recalling here. That was a shitty flash. Yeah, we got three shutdowns now, chat. Maybe I can finally show you guys how to win with 0 20 teams. Oh, no, wrong with me. recall here. This guy is too strong for me. Don't even sure if it's correct. I don't, I'm not too sure how to itemize on my champion. I'll be very honest with you, chat. Ooh, I'm going here. What the hell? That's a fat wave. Oh, never mind. We go, though. I knew he didn't have flash yet from last time when I burned it at a tier 2. And I know Kim didn't have flash. You, so you don't defend top with tier 2, and then when we have to play for third dragon, then we're top. And we recall. You see how shaky this guy is moving? It's because he doesn't want to move here because he's scared of my ass. Oh, I may have grieved. Fine. That's a good flash. Alright, we can get it. Nice. She flashed here. I'm gonna walk around. Nice job, Kaisa. Thank you for joining the team fight. I'm gonna burn both our flashes, maybe. Okay, never mind, I guess. I should have built armor. Yeah, I didn't build armor, so I actually got one shot. That's my bad. That's the downside of not having like a Zonyas or something here, right? My build is probably really horrific this game, but that's one thing I should probably study how to itemize on this champion, because I think my items are gonna make it hard for me to carry this game. What? Enemy team is probably coming to me, so I can't continue. I just gotta keep their tempo very well. My team could have done Nesher with all four moving, but yeah. They also probably didn't know that they're actually gonna all four move to me, right? Why are you both? This guy's monkey IRL in game. I'm gonna slow push the wave here so this wave walks up a little bit further. I can push both. That will give me tempo and it will force Garen to stick into the sideline here. 2k gold for this. So now I'm gonna collect this wave and then I'm gonna move to mid as fast as I can. And Garen is gonna be forced to collect two side waves here. So now I'm gonna move to mid. Garen has to collect this wave and next wave. And I'm gonna be here if my team is already dead. Nice. It's good. Look, Garen is forced to collect this and this, and I'm gonna be mid. This is how you win games. Tempest to side My team already won the fight for me. Okay, I don't even have to do anything. My team that was hard losing actually did it for me. My macro still here was perfect though. Oriana has no flash. Oriana has a death wish. Okay, I need to get 2k gold, so I have Zonia, so I'm gonna farm top wave after. I chat, looks like I'm winning again because of better team, I guess. Yo, solo ranked and only! Thank you for the massive rate! Welcome, everybody! I'm doing unranked to masters on every top lane champion, pretty much. And I just finished uh, Garen, we got two masters, and now I'm doing Jax. So, we're doing the education stuff. I can't miss this cannon, because then I don't have my Zonias. Okay, lovely, we got our Zonias now. We were losing the entire game because my bot lane was uh, really griefing, but we finally got a good team fight. We got Nash, and now the game is winnable. So, here. I hope you had an amazing stream, bro. Thank you so much for the rate. Uh, it's really bad whenever somebody dies during Nash. If you guys didn't know, Baron lasts for 3 minutes with 3 minutes, which means she generally speaking gonna have on average around 6 waves of Nashers to play with. If somebody dies, that's minus 3 waves, so half your Nashers instantly gone. And then she also has to like walk back to lane again, and we have to like set up again, people are gonna recall, people are taking camp, so... Our Nash is pretty much already completely nullified with one death. That's okay, we can still get this... Okay. Bot lane feeling, thought it was an SRO thing, I think it's a top lane thing, bro. We're level 18 here. I don't think I should be looking for sideline plays here. Uh, I guess my team is using a tempo on dragon, so I gotta be careful. This guy's isolated. Kindred is not here. Okay, I'm sure trolling. Yeah, What's going on? That guy is good. No bueno. No bueno, I trolled, I guess we're going for Garen. I don't know how Oriana is able to kill all my teammates there though, like 4v1. I don't, that looks so weird. This team fight looks so weird to me. Misfortune and Garen were on me. So how are my teammates even dead? And Nautilus even ulted me as well. I don't understand this team fight, it's a head scratcher, man. Kinder's here. I'm down to fight, that guy's no flesh. Okay. 
Yeah, no, this is good. This is good. He has no flash. Nice. I get the buffs. Wow, my team played this well. I tried to ignite. I couldn't. My team played this so well, actually. Holy shit. Well done. So flash as well. This Lilia is playing really well the whole game. Uh oh. I'm gonna push the wave here. Wow. Did you actually just win the game? Well, that's how you win with a 0 10 team, I guess. Me and Lilia played well. Nice. I got an E. Oh, she got an O pop. What a lovely game. Alright, chat. Now you then say, uh, I, I know you did only climbing because of team devs. Oh, bitch. You can climb it either way too. I can carry too. Jax is a good champion to carry. Salute, brothers. Yeah.